He's just a master musician. He could play three notes and it would sound like, like a, a ten note chord. He probably influenced uh, most guitar players who have ever listened to him. His contribution to what I do and to what everybody else does after him is immeasurable. Ed's just one of the best. Well, Ed's approach to playing the guitar in many ways was uh, almost pianistic in that he, he made the guitar sound like there was more than one thing going on. Um, he might do something like the... He, I was playing a bass note and some other notes in the chord, and it would sort of sound like I was playing a piano in like different registers, like a bass line. And then he would play a melody. He might play... Before, um, I might have played a, a phrase like this. Ed might play it like this. Uh, he had this, this very beautiful, dark, warm sort of tone. So he might play something like... something like that. You know, he'd play these, you know, like these beautiful chords, you know, where the open string is dissonant a little bit, but then he'd quickly resolve it kind of thing. And um, and to me, he was just super smooth. When it said, uh, you know, play like Ed Bickert, um, uh, you know, the chords, you know, would be stuff like... Um, people ask me, you know, do you get nervous playing in front of crowds? I'm like, no, I don't. But, you know, if Ed Bickert's in the audience, I certainly do, you know. We would always laugh and go, wow, it says Ed Bickert on there. Now I'm in trouble. I'm going to have to play beautifully. <laughs> Great inspiration. Uh, nobody imitates Ed. Is he Ed? <laughs>